babbling system, which includes the HP 1400 babbler and the P3000 power converter, which take advantage of all the benefits of high frequency for an excellent babbling package. High frequency has dramatically longer service life than a traditional tool. You can run these 24-7 duty cycles. They're brushless, so they're essentially maintenance-free. And the speed stability is, is excellent. There's no drop of speed under load whatsoever. The motor has extremely high specific output. It's got unparalleled power to weight ratio, making this a very light and compact machine. It's only 3.9 kilograms. And it's also got very low noise. It has an excellent anti-vibration design. Both the main handle and the side handle have anti-vibration isolation. It comes standard with a 45 degree 3 insert tool holder. We also have available a 30 degree tool holder. The 45 degree tool holder also can use special inserts for creating an external radius. We have available a R2.5, R3.5 and R4.0. The power converter is designed to operate on both 220 volt three phase and 220 volt single phase supply. It has an LCD display screen showing the speed setting and adjusts from 6000 to 8550 RPM by pressing the buttons up or down in increments of 150. And it remembers the speed setting from the last time it was turned on. Every machine comes standard with the anti-vibration side handle a T15 Torx wrench, the special hook spanner wrench for removing the tool holder, a face spanner wrench, the 45 degree tool holder including the impeller and three carbide inserts installed, and an M4 T-hex wrench. We have the special shielded coupling cable available in lengths of 10, 20, and 30 meters. And to change the tool holder, first need to remove the support deck. And so you need to loosen the two lock screws. Now remove the support deck by unscrewing it. Lift it away. And engage the tool holder. And it unscrews. The carbide inserts are indexable. So they have four faces that can be used. And so if one side is worn, you can simply loosen the screw and then turn to the next unworn face. And we provide the Torx driver. Simply loosen, turn, and then retighten. Now this tool holder is set up for straight beveling. This is a 45 degree tool holder. But it is also possible to use the same tool holder for doing different radii. There's a clearance behind the insert which allows an you to perform an external radius. And to switch over to different radii is very simple. All you need to do is change the impeller. Each radius will have a different impeller and it's clearly marked. And then you just change the inserts. And here we'll put it on the machine. And replace the support deck. For setting the beveling depth, you need a machinist square, and then you measure between the support deck and the cutting face of the insert. So let's set it to three millimeters. And then you tighten the screw. When you're using radius inserts, it's important to have the deck aligned with the insert. So you use a straight edge, and you adjust until they are perfectly aligned. There, that's just right. And then you tighten your screw. Now open the cover. Line up the tangs. And insert into the socket. And tighten the ring. Hand tight is fine. Now line up the tangs. They will only go one way. And tighten the ring. Now press the power button to energize the converter and the RPM will be displayed. And you can adjust the speed by pressing the up or down buttons. Right now it's at the maximum, 8550. And each pre press of the button will change 150 RPMs. First allow it to come up to full operating speed before you contact the workpiece. 
and you can lock by pressing the lock button. Now we'll perform a 45 degree bevel. We can also do an internal bevel. 